Today, my rescue cockatoo Morticia is going to help me save a life with a blood transfusion. This cockatoo patient is suffering from a life-threatening anemia due to a viral infection. We collect blood under anesthesia in order to keep the patient perfectly still. Blood is drawn from the jugular vein into a syringe that is prepared with an anticoagulant to prevent the blood from clotting before donation. The amount of blood that we can safely take is dependent on the patient's body weight. Before waking up from anesthesia, we will give the patient fluids to help make up for the blood that they donated. Once the blood is collected, we need to perform a cross match. This tests to see if there's any reaction between the two birds' blood. If any reaction is noted, that means it isn't safe to use the blood for a transfusion. In this case, there's no signs of a reaction in the cross matching process, so the blood is safe to use. Blood is given over time through a special filter into a catheter. Typically, we will use an IV catheter, but in this patient's case, they were too sick and required an intraosseous catheter. I'm happy to report this patient did very well with the transfusion, and Morticia was happy to help out her new friend.